Watch you guys got another fix video here for you for one of those little pesky little bugs that you get with Windows 10. This is when you try to remove Bluetooth devices from your Windows 10 operating system. So let's go to the settings tab here and go into our devices. Now if you use Bluetooth on Windows 10 you'll have a rake of uh, Bluetooth devices that are connected and not connected and you can see here when you click on the remove device uh, it will start to try to remove it say are you sure you want to remove this device you say yes and then what will happen is it will go through the process of trying to remove it and then what happens is you'll get this error message coming up you can see it's starting to remove the device by saying remove device and once we get to the next bit it will say failed so there we go it says remove failed and then what it does is it reconnects again just like so now this has been plaguing Windows 10 for quite some time, but let me show you how you can try to resolve this problem. Uh, it's quite straightforward and easy to do. So close off the settings box and right click on the start button here. And what we want to do is you want to go to device manager here. Now once you're inside device manager, what you want to look for is your Bluetooth uh, setting up the top. You should see that Bluetooth logo there. Click on this one and open up the little tree here. There we go. So once you open this up, you should see a bunch of devices connected. Go up to view and then show hidden devices. Now you may see some translucent type uh, devices. You can remove those if you wish, if you're not using them. And you can see a bunch of uh, Bluetooth devices that have been connected to this computer. Now sometimes they can conflict and cause problems. So if you don't want to uh, have them on there anymore, you can uninstall them and remove them just like so. And this is probably the quickest and easier way to remove them, especially if you've got issues uh, where it's trying to remove it or you don't need it on there anymore uh, you can just come in here and uninstall them like so now you're not going to cause any harm by doing this so let me just quickly uninstall this there we go so they're all removed and what you want to do is once you've removed these you want to restart your computer so i'm just going to quickly close this off and restart the system let's go ahead and quickly restart now once we've restarted this what we can do is run the troubleshooter for Bluetooth and uh, I'll show you how to do that. Sometimes that can fix any sort of little glitches or problems uh, with Bluetooth. So what we want to do is go down to the search box here and type trouble and uh, once you put that in there you should see troubleshoot settings. Let that box open up and then what you want to uh, Bluetooth. There we go. Fix uh, Bluetooth problems so just run the troubleshooter run the troubleshooter and this will start to try to detect any problems with your Bluetooth that you may be having so just let that run through it does take a bit of time so be patient and normally it's not a major problem it's just some sort of little glitch or a bug and this this has been going on for quite a few versions of Windows 10 you can see here we've got a fixed icon there now and we also have a green tick now what you want to do here now is go into your services just to make sure the services are running and they are on the right settings here so open up the services pane go into services and we're just going to check the bluetooth services to make sure they are running because i know a lot of people do use tools to uh, tweak their services and it may have been uh, disabled or something like that so just make sure that is running you can always stop it and start it again if you've got problems so just make sure these three bluetooth settings are running now they are set to manual uh, but you could have them on automatic if you wish but i'm leaving them as default and just make sure they're running which they are and once that's uh, completed you can come out here and go back to uh, the settings pane here and open up the devices tab and then we're going to check here now you may see already there might be an icon there that you could just remove now we have uninstalled it but if it's still there you just remove it and it should actually remove from the system there we go and what we want to do now is go back into the settings here so I closed it off and gone back in and you should have a clear Bluetooth uh, list here there should be no Bluetooth uh, in there now because I've removed them and there you go that's pretty much it hopefully that resolves your problem so if that's how you can uh, fix the failed to remove Bluetooth devices on a Windows 10 machine my name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk 
If you've got any other video requests, then leave them in the comments section below. And I shall see you again for another video real soon. Have a great weekend, guys. Catch you later. Bye for now. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.